Hello everyone, it's Is, and today I'm having a very special guest. Her name is Sophie, she's my dog, and I will be transforming her into a beautiful princess. Since I had some fabric left from my last video, I decided to make her very own veil dress, so let's see how this turns out. I took the patterns from a vest she already has and these are basically the pieces that I had to cut but everything has to be double. Then I proceeded to pin the three pieces together like so and this time I decided to use a sewing machine since it's a bigger piece it's going to be faster in that way. As I said before, everything has to be double, that's why I joined the two pieces like so and I will sew them down by the neck. Making it double will help me to have a better result at the end and make it look polished. Now very carefully I'll be joining each of the four sides under the armhole and that way I will sew them down. After that it's a good time to see if it actually fits on her and I think so far it looks good. I don't think I have to make any adjustment so I will leave it like that. Now I have to join everything around the armholes and for this I'm making small cuts to make it easier and also I will pin everything down. to sew down the zipper and it's okay if it's a bit too long it doesn't matter you can always trim that for the decorations I used a long stripe of tulle and this I will be sewing down all around the neck and I am almost done I really like the way this is turning out and also I want to mention if you are new in YouTube and just started a channel just let me know in the comments if you want me to support your channel and I will I'm actually looking for friends and someone to share opinions and experiences since I started a channel as well and yeah I'm just sewing down this piece so I can pin it and position it in place And after securing the tool, this is how it looks like, I decided to sew it down just from the front and from the back. And finally, for the skirt, I just cut a long rectangle of the chiffon and I will be sewing it down in the back of the corset. 
and that's it the only thing left will be to secure the bottom of the corset This is a quick shot of how it looks when it's finished from the front and from the back and next I will show you how it actually looks in the model and that is it I'm actually very surprised that she let me try the dress on hair I hope you like it and as I told you before if you want me to support your channel and support each other just let me know in the comments and if you have any suggestion just let me know as well. Thank you so much for watching and see you next time. Bye bye.